hidey hidey ho. So, Romac Studios has Traveler's decks. These are Oracle cards, and I am pulling three from each deck for the lunar, partial lunar eclipse that's happening in Taurus, the second house ruler of I have. Okay, guys? So, big one to come up right now, especially when everybody's fucking broke. Woo! And popped up number 11, which is kind of funny. This is deck three, Revelations with Runes. It's a $20 deck as it's a rune deck, okay? So runes don't necessarily have numbers, but I put numbers on them because it's my deck. And this is cattle, fihu. I can never pronounce these right. Uh, it's so funny too, because runes and ravens would like shoot me in the face. Represents wealth, assets, and possessions. All right, so I'm pulling from all five of my decks. So if you saw this one, it was meant for you. Okay, because I'm doing collective readings. Three cards from each deck. Interesting. Then we got Giant, okay, which is Teresa's. And it represents suffering, motivation, defense against adversaries. And then we got Hira, which is Year, okay? The coming and the going, just like the Pisces sign. Represents harvest, reward, and abundance. So what do I read from this? Right? You're working your butt off. You feel like it's not going anywhere? Keep persisting. Keep loving. Keep working. Keep believing in yourself. It'll bring you grounding and abundance like you've never believed possible. Sending love. Have a great weekend. Ciao.